I've actually lived in Dannyvirk all my life. My um, family have actually been there for at least 100 years. Uh, my wife actually come from Weaver and um, she actually moved into town after the shop burnt down there her parents used to own. And uh, the whole story is really that she moved in to come and find me, but uh, she's probably got a different version on that one there. Living in a rural community, um, one thing is you haven't got traffic lights, parking meters, you haven't got motorways. I mean, I can get to work in five minutes. Um, it's a beautiful place to be, country life, easy going, uh, all the people in town are nice and friendly. I mean, uh, look what you've got out here. I mean, it's only an hour from Dannyburg, it's perfect. We um, normally finish work at about five o'clock on a Friday, pack the car up, head out to the coast here. We've got a little batch in the camping ground here. And uh, we just come out here, order tea, we've got a little takeaway shop. Then we go up and have a quiet beer at the club. They even deliver your tea up there. It's like a big family. And uh, the whole community here all stick together and go out fishing in the morning, we go diving, uh, power, crayfish, go out boat fishing, catching groper, trumpeter, uh, a lot of blue cod, terakee. You can actually go down the river fishing for kawai. There's um, actually a guy got a kingi here yesterday, a 10.4 kg, and uh, that was just off the beach. If you wanted to move into the Taurua, there's plenty of towns you can move into, and uh, you've got the beaches close by, you've got, you've got hunting up in the hills, you've got trout fishing, Every, everything's just there on your doorstep.